Alrighty, I'm sure a lot of you out there would like to be able to put a smaller drill bit in your Dremel. And there's a pretty simple way to do that. One day I had to use it for something or another I was making and I needed a tinier drill bit. So if I'm going to take this one here, for example, this here would be a number, this is a numbered bit, so it's probably like a number 54. So if I tighten this all the way down, of course it's just going to wobble. So we want to be able to use that drill bit in there. So what you want to do is just get some thin wire, copper wire. And what you're going to do, just kind of take your time with it. It'll only take you a few minutes. And just put that piece of wire there. And then just start wrapping. Okay, now once you get up here to reach the right the thickness, you're going to do this one more time. I mean, you can drill through metal, steel, wood. It works out really well. All right, we're going to cut it off right there. Great Chinese scissors, scissors here. All righty. And see what happens. Got to drill some holes using these wooden dowels. I've got some little project here I'm working on, so we'll give it a spin. Pretty smooth here, doesn't it? There we go. Pretty cool, huh? Alrighty, so that's that part of it. Another thing you can do, I know you are loving this, this is really great though. And you can also save, save that piece of wire and you can always reuse it for your Dremel. See there? That's good for your number. 54 drill bit. There you go. Now, another problem you all have. Here we go. Here's this guy. Now, I'll try to put a number 54 bit in this thing. Ain't gonna happen. Same deal. Tighten this up all you want. Still going to slide right out. And this one here, we're only going to use, I'm going to use a single strand. So I'm only going to go one time on this one. But this is the only way you're going to get a Number 54 bit or even tinier will actually work in that drill and work great. It's one of those little tricks of the trade. It really comes in handy, I'll tell you. Alrighty, here we go. Yeah, 
here. I'll give you a real, real close shot of it. Okay, here you go. I'm gonna go ahead and turn it on. Notice how straight it is. No wobble on that bit. Same deal here. Take your drill bit out. Save this little sleeve for the next job. And you've got two. One for the big drill and one for the little drill. Take some thin wire here, just like this right here which you can get at Walmart. You have to go over in the craft section. They got them in little displays of like eight different colors. And it's a pretty thin wire. And so I'm taking this little number drill bit. I can't remember what number it is, but it's very, very small. I've seen some as almost the size of a sewing needle. Okay, we'll go through a key, how's that? I'm not going to go all the way through it, of course, I'm going through the table. Uh, here we go. There you go, huh? 